Welcome back. You are watching Rock Tour Live right here on White Purple TV. We're all about rock music, so if you're requesting, put that in mind, right? Now, thank you so much for staying with us. I can see Frederick Klaus and Asama Hey there. I'm tuning in from Voi Taita. And during the show, you're making my satire awesome. And you're making ours just by watching the show and being right here. Uh, someone else says, if time allows it, please play me a Broken by Sita featuring Amy Lee. Now, we just played Sita, their newest release. We just played it right here it's called the dangerous one of our top three songs at six make sure you go vote your favorite now the first song is by rich the song is kindy or very on rich from uh, kenya obviously and then you have dream state the song is um uh, are you are you ready to leave and then the third song of course is by sita dangerous it's on our on our tira go vote and then um freddy kanasama wonderful such pure awesomeness we agree with you thank you so so much for being here now guess what i told you i've been telling you for the longest time we have our guests they're going to be joining us right here in studio and here they are despite <laughs> covid they managed to pull through and they are right here so i'm, I'm just gonna go ahead and let you guys say hello <laughs> and then we're gonna go ahead i love him to introduce after we introduce so i'm gonna start on my far right Hi guys, my name is Saras. Hi, this is Kanyaki. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now people can finally, you know, yeah, people yeah, can yeah. finally put the face to the name. We talk about Ka Kanyaki like every single show because he is always watching, he's always tweeting. So we're like, oh, shout out to Kanyaki, by the way, yeah. he's single out, da, 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 da. always talking about him. Mm. This is Kanyaki, Team oh. Rock Tour Kanyaki. Us. Now you mm. put the name to the face. He made it. Welcome to the studio once again. This is not the first time. Yeah. Ah, not one time. It's the first time this year. Oh, this year. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Welcome back. How are you guys doing? It's been a while. Oh, we are good. Mm -hmm. Actually, thank God for everything. Yeah. Uh, despite the co the pandemic of uh, COVID-19. Yeah. <laughs> we are still surviving. And We're we are surviving. doing things uh, in the bedroom or the <laughs> sitting room. Huh? Yeah. But when I just say trip me fridge in a bedroom, a sitting room, <laughs> you know, you just peek. We are snacking a lot. Like, that's all we are doing. Sure. But now, for someone who's never heard about Kanyeki, they don't mm. know who you are, what you're all about, can you just go ahead and reintroduce yourselves? Yourselves um, with an S. Yeah. Okay, I used to be one man. Kanyeki <laughs> used to be one man, but uh, yeah. I got a couple of guys and uh, we came up with a band. Right. And uh, it's the first Kenyan uh, rock band that does uh, gospel yeah. in a vernacular language. That mm -hmm. is cool. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are proud of it. Yes, and we yes. are proud of you. Yeah. Like totally, we are 100% very proud of you. Yep. And how about you? What do you do for the band? Because you're part of Kanyeki as well, right? Um, I'm usually on the back line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I play drums. He's the drummer. Ladies, we have a drummer in the building. Yeah? Right? <laughs> and what most people don't know is that his skills right here, our DJ, was actually part of Kanyeki. Yes, he was my guitarist. Huh? <laughs> uh, but I wish I could just ask you what happened, but we're going to be talking to him in a minute. But today we're just going to yeah. focus on Kanyeke. You're the reason we are Whoa. here. So, okay, before we even get started with the interview and everything, before you even play for us, I want to know, you know, um, COVID-19, it has affected all of us, like across the world. Most people are like uh, dealing with it. Yep. So uh, what are you most grateful for despite COVID-19? Because that's what I'm asking everybody, even the guys at home. What are you most grateful for? Uh, can I encourage people with the uh, verse? Yes, please Don't. do. Please Let me do. have my Bible. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not uh, I will read uh, in the uh, not the book of. He's giving uh, us a verse, people. A verse. We told yes. you, Kanyaki is not just a rock artist. He is a gospel rock artist. Uh, I'll just guess this. I I, I don't have the specific uh, verse and chapter, but I will read the. Uh, the Bible says that uh, after Noah built the ark, mm -hmm. it lay for forty days mm -hmm. and forty nights. Uh, but came the fourth one, right. and the lay stopped mm -hmm. so the challenge that you're going through today you know tomorrow a day will come and it's coming soon right and it will all end despite the covid 
despite everything, maybe the struggles that you are going through, they will come to end. Yeah. Uh, to me, the fourth one, it means uh, the pattern that the number fourth one represents the door of a new day. Yeah. That's the reason I'm saying the fourth one is coming. The hope, the promise, if you don't quit, mm -hmm. the rain will stop. I don't okay. know which kind of a lane is on your life or my life or Silas' life, yeah. but hey, the Bible says that the lane will stop, mm -hmm. the giants will fall, All right. and you will enter the promised land. God believe in second chances. Mm -hmm. you will your vision will be fulfilled. Mm -hmm. It's around the corner. So keep there. Your fourth one is coming. Our keep the one, hope alive and the faith alive. It's coming. Our fourth one is coming, people. Sure. Who is inspired? Yo, can you shout an amen? I didn't oh, hear amen. any amen, dude. Yo, Muroni Angusha, Buddha, amen. Amen. Yeah, our fourth one is coming. <laughs> I don't have to do that to me, my <laughs> Alright, well thank you so much for making time just sure. to be here today. Now you are a rocker, you, you are a rock artist and in mm -hmm. Kenya, you know rock is not mainstream in Kenya sure, sure. yet. I like to say yet, yeah, you know that's why we're here. Mm -hmm. It's not mainstream yet, mm -hmm. <laughs> but we'll hopefully we are getting there. Now, um, what are some of the how 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 do you deal with that because being being just an artist is hard now being a rock artist is another thing so um mm -hmm. what are some of the challenges you encounter being a rocker that you know non rockers don't go through uh, <laughs> one is production right and uh finding a good producer is hard very who, hard who gets what you do yes uh, but the main one is actually for the video uh, audio, I do believe because uh, the guy usually work for me mm -hmm. used to be my actually used to be, used to be my guitarist, mm -hmm. so he's my producer. Although now he's talking to car, he. That's one challenge. <laughs> Secondly, is market. Mm -hmm. I wish guys can uh, just go and uh, think of uh, they recognize rock as uh, the same same genre of music that right. is there like reggae, hip hop, and etc. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, so Sarah, do you just uh, play drums for Kanye alone, or do you even play in the ma mainstream industry? Like, if someone wants to, has a live show, they want you to come play with them. Do you do that, or you're just like a hundred percent about rock music? You you perform for a rock band other than Kanye, or you are just like a, you you're free to play in any for anyone rather? Um, so far, I'm just playing for Kanye. Well, I'm still open for options, you know, it's all about the money. Right. Mm. Yes, please, someone finally <laughs> said it. No someone hard feelings, said it. baby. <laughs> no hard feelings. <laughs> but, money. Yeah. yeah, usually, that's, I'm um, just playing for Kanyeki at the moment. Right now for yeah. Kanyeki, but he is open. Guys, ladies, money. gentlemen, he is open to play for anyone, as long as there's money. <laughs> He's doing this for passion. But come up with Kakiru, yes, he's gonna definitely <laughs> come through. Hmm? Now, I know this for a fact. There are some people who listen to rock, but then yep. they'll never admit it, like in front of people. When you like, oh, this, this, um, this, this thing people feel like, Siju, you rock, Siju, you are a He is not, he is a go he, he's a rocker who actually plays gospel music. So what do you tell someone who, like that? Someone who's pretentious and just like faking it. They love rock, but pretend not to. What do you tell them? Uh, very simple thing. <laughs> be yourself. Be yourself. Yeah, be original. Uh, is that what people just are, go are going to say mm -hmm. about that. Yeah. No, um, I want to also know about uh, your latest jam. Mm -hmm. You have a new jam out. It's called Mwega. Yeah, boy. <laughs> For those guys goodness. who don't know. And actually, he's going to be launching it right here. Okay, you actually launched it. But <laughs> we played it. We actually featured it on our, to on our top three. We actually featured it like two weeks. Was it two weeks ago? I think, yeah, that should, be, oh. that should have been two weeks ago. We played it right here. And we absolutely loved it. So tell us the inspiration behind that. Where does the inspiration come from, Mwega? And what is Mwega actually all about? What is Mwega? Mwega is basically good. <laughs> Kikui for good. <laughs> good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Sour. Uh, yeah. And now, what, what does this song have to do with good? <laughs> uh, the song is uh, just based on the book uh, of Psalms. Dude, it comes from the Bible. Did you guys yes. realize? It's uh, actually in the Bible. <laughs> uh -huh. Psalms chapter um, 34, yeah. verses 8. I just read the Bible. Uh, the verse says that, taste and see the Lord is good. Mm -hmm. 
Blessed is the man who takes refuge in him. Mm -hmm. Yes. You taste and see how God is. Taste and see how good God, God is. Yeah. That's, that's what the song says. Yes. All right, but in a rock way. Yeah, in a rock way. <laughs> Amen. Yeah. In a rock way. Amen. He, so hey, he's gonna, he, he, now, he, he, he's scared. He's like, amen. Then he yeah. makes sure when he's like, oh, amen. Can we get an amen? Like, yes. I'm all about that. Like, uh, but now, uh, I, I understand, like, um, like what you said, like, uh, fr first of all, yeah. production and everything yes. is hard. But why aren't we getting videos? You know, like, most strokers are not giving us videos. When uh, is the video from where guy dropping? Because mm -hmm. that's actually a main challenge when you're playing... For radio is fine, but when yeah. you're playing on TV, that becomes like really hard playing audio on TV. So when is the video dropping? Let me say that I can't promise that for now, because mm -hmm. uh, the COVID, aim it chopper. Because <laughs> before the COVID, before March, we had uh, scheduled to do a video mm -hmm. for Munene Right. And now due to the COVID thing, no traveling, from, uh, I think from Nairobi to where the borders and everything, mm -hmm. uh, we went back. So now you have another project, I don't know when to do this video. Okay. Yeah. But hopefully when COVID ends, we actually get COVID. the video. You're That's not even one. Probably We're going to get videos. Video is not awesome. One. We're yeah. keeping our fingers crossed. Yeah. Now, Sirius, what's the best thing about being a drummer for you? Like, what inspires you to just wake up and you're like, oh, you know what, I love what I do. What's the best thing about doing that? <laughs> Because I think basically uh -huh. it's I'm the one who says what the band does. Ah, okay, yeah. he calls the shots. Uh, <laughs> I keep the time, by the way. I just keep the time. <laughs> he does. Yeah. Does he keep time? Yeah. Hmm? Actually, he yeah. got here before you. Yeah. So that's true. He's that's actually okay. <laughs> That makes sense. Oh, I, know, I know most people want to hear what Mwega is all about, and I am down for that. So are you ready? You're going to be playing for us, right? Do you make a uh, guitar? Man? Is it no, uh, guitar? I'm a prop. You know, you can't even prop you say, man. Don't you do that? <laughs> but if you're playing for, what song are you playing for? Uh, I wanted to play the, uh, the song called Karamu Naifuko, A Pen and a Book. All right. That's what I, it's called. Pen yes. and a Book. Karamu Naifuko. So. All right. Yeah. Kiki with speakers and uh, they've gotten it. <laughs> but non speakers, maybe like most of our fans at home, that means it's a pen. And a book. book. Are you ready to do this? Are you ready? It's you yeah. I'm talking to Yeah, you, right? I'm good, I'm good. Okay, so then you know, take it away. My... I'll just be here. I can't hear my voice. <laughs> Takoraya me kuruine edumaya geko no gai ari hamwe na idwe na nekio toki nyete ha ha ne joya karamu na ifuku nyadekere mami witsorwe po. Sirio geta ke de no yo de Takoraya me kuruine edumaya geko no gai ari hamwe na idwe na nekio toki nyete ha ha ne joya karamu na ifuku nyadekere mami wito rwebo Geta ke de no yo de. All right. <laughs> 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 I mean, that is that was 
absolutely amazing. You know, nice and easy. You just got everybody vibing. Kim Chapa too. You know as well, yeah? We just like feeling the vibe and everything. Cool. That one was amazing. But now my director and I said, "Uli zoko li kula tutu kanya na tutu." So can you please? Can you please? For the nice speakers. Jaribu oh, to translate okay. yeah, kid dog so that everybody gets it. Uh Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot this song I, I wrote uh, basically I don't know feelings mm -hmm. but uh, this song is addressed to our moms the moms who are out there mm -hmm. and the dads who are out there alright uh, not to give up right not to lose hope mm -hmm. but keep fight yeah Yo. I think this song is dedicated to our parents who are out there okay yeah we don't get most of that, so that is dope. At least now we know. It's not just few skills. When you're doing Mother's Day, Father's Day, now yeah. we have a play we have one to add on our yeah. playlist. Yeah. Okay. Now I wanna know what is what has been your highlights in the game? Like what's been your biggest stage so far? What have you achieved so far? Oh. And you're like, yo, that was good. I actually got to play there. Uh huh. Apart from Nigeria, I was in Qatar last year in the March of, I think on March. Yeah. Did you hear that? You're in Qatar? Yep. Yo, being a rocker is cool. Kulanto yeah. was a member of Kenya for years. <laughs> They've never been even to Uganda, guys. So uh, if you're not a rocker, I don't know what you're waiting for. Oh, please, God grace. <laughs> now, so, okay, it's are you... Not mm -hmm. us, but... It's about him. Yeah, it's about the big man upstairs. Yes. Yeah, shout out to him as well. Yeah. We're here because of him, right? Yeah. Okay, so what do you miss? What do you miss most about, like, you know, we're not living in normal times. So what do you miss most? Be oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, know, yeah. to try Corona, say. What, what, what's corona. the first thing you're going? The first to thing do? I think uh, after the Corona, Kuisha, the first thing I think I will do, mm. I'll go to church. <laughs> the second right. thing I can't wait to go for gigs. That's gigs, one thing that you man. Know. I yeah. know gigs. I I And yesterday I was just feeling nostalgic. If you're here, just head over to our Twitter. And that's at uh, Rock Tour Two Five Four. Just check out the videos. We have performances from the mm -hmm. gigs before, and I'm just like, we need these days back, man. Yeah. What, what do you miss most, yeah, Cyrus? Yeah, what do you yeah. miss most, Boris? Before, like, what were you enjoying before Corona that you can't right now? The one thing you miss the most. Um, studio sessions. Oh, yeah, that too. sessions, concerts, you know. Right. Mm. Uh, I know I have to shed a lot of weight for that because yeah. I have to really <laughs> some weight. <laughs> so, because basically, I've been doing pillow drums in the house. Mm. So I'm really looking forward to like, going back to the same. Right. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Me too. We are all definitely looking forward to that. And Kanyaki, also, yep. I need you to inspire the guys at home. You know, like, um, you know, there, there are people in the, maybe not even in the rock scene, some who are even in the mainstream scene. Kuna a lot of gigs, like, I learned weekend, kuna gig, and I'll get my 2,000, I'll get my 20 Gs. There's none of that. So, what will you tell them, like, uh, maybe just try give them hope, and maybe if you have a business, what will you tell them, like, maybe just try give them hope, and maybe if you have a business idea, I'm going to say what Twingy, they say that you are saying awesome media space who they've turned to YouTube. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. You know? Well, that's one way. Do you have an alternative? What else can they do and what would you just tell them during this period? Wow, this period. Yeah. I think we have, uh, we can start at some bees, huh? with the less than a, a K, let me see that. Mm -hmm. We can do some uh, smoky, my eye, but about those guys is the Nene. Okay. You can stand up. Right. Because he's there. Or Leos, uh, if you are blessed to have uh, maybe a moti. Uh, look like for vegetables and then uh, you sell. Go the, yes, even in our estate there are yeah. those people. Like, mm -hmm. um, what's your magari say you wanna wanna hawk? Like, not actually, it's not, is it hawking? Can you call no, it you hawking? Could. Like, they, they hawk like uh, fruits and mm -hmm. vegetables. Yeah. When I could zone out, 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 when I could Oh, uh, you're selling your yes, as a, as a, as a yes, you know. I was like, yeah, that's the hassle, but yeah, desperate times, yeah. Desperate, desperate times, measures, yeah. yeah, and these are desperate you're times, to to <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah, also, another thing, um, who inspires you, or who would you want to be like? Like, if you get to that level, you're like, 
do they made it mama you made it it's like who's that one person or two i don't know uh there's this guy called um i look upon now mm he's -hmm. called mike kennedy all right this is uh, the real vocalist for the band out of reach mm -hmm. i should know the guy that uh i do follow actually when you listen to my music sometimes if you're very keen listening to my music mm -hmm. if you feel that car element somewhere mm -hmm. of out of reach somewhere all right yeah. we absolutely love ultra bridge as well yeah. we play them sometimes so we dig it who like maybe as as an artist come a drama come on who's the one person that inspires you before you wrap this up we have to play some of your music before time mm. before time runs out mm. travis baka yeah <laughs> travis okay he's been doing a lot nai corona has been doing a lot He's been working with MGK, even um, this, 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 with most hip hop artists actually. Uh, even Post Malone, they even did something together. So Travis Becker, who else? Malin Sata. For All right. Uh, yeah. So there's two inspirations. Cool. Mm -hmm. Your last ones. Oh, your last ones on your social media before we play your music. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You start. Not then you. Kanyaki. Not me. You. Uh, social media at Sairo. <laughs> Sairo? Yeah. Just that. Simple. Okay, spell it. S I R E R A W. All right, Sierra. But most guys read it as Sierra. Sierra. I okay. do call it Sierra. Yeah. Always on the show. Musa my Sierra. Can you Where can people find your music? And those looking to buy your music, where can people buy your music? If it's on YouTube, what channel and social media as well? Actually, uh, YouTube is only free. They download for free. <laughs> so we go to Bandcamp. Mm -hmm. We have some out there. Mm -hmm. And uh, social media, we are on uh, hmm? Twitter, at Kanyeki254. Right, Kanyeki254. Mm -hmm. Do follow him, guys. Make sure yeah, you follow him. Kanyeki254. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The same, right. same thing in you know, Instagram, mm -hmm. it's just Kanyeki. Cool. Yeah, and we are looking for guys to subscribe to our channel. Yes, do mm, subscribe we are already, on the yeah, YouTube channel, which YouTube. is Kanyeki, Kanyeki, Kanyeki yes. No, no, Kanyeki Band. Just Kanyeki Band. Mm, yeah. All right, that's on YouTube. Make sure you do that. And he's, he, he has a video coming out. No, video, videos, videos coming videos. out. And we're looking forward to that. Yeah. So right now, we're going to be taking a very short break. Come back and we're going to be playing you a performance from, are you guys ready? Mm -hmm. Heavy on the Beast Awards. Just a snippet, a little bit of oh that. Yeah. Then wow. play you, okay. Mwega, then come back to wrap the show. <laughs>